All right, cool. Basically, as you guys know, yeah, me and my brother, we like to, you know, right. check out different experiences. We like to, you know, go to the worst review places and we like to... Oh, my days. The flipping mic announcement thing is ruining my intro again. And as you can tell by the title, we're about to go on a sleeper train. Yeah, Caledonian, that's, that's it. It's, it's called the Caledonian sleeper, yeah. Caledonian sleeper. Yeah, we're about to go on the Caledonian sleeper. We're at Houston, yes. as you can see. Our train is at 9.34, something like that. It's about 8.30 now, so we've got like an hour. Wow. And yeah, man, we're going to check out this experience and tell you guys how it is to go on a sleeper train in the UK. So if you guys are new around there, please go now and subscribe. Uh, like the video if you do enjoy the video and go follow me on Instagram. And uh, yeah, are you ready to get this experience started? Yes. I just finished packing for our sleeper train journey and uh, I want to show you guys this week's progress on my ukulele. As I've mentioned before, I have teamed up with Fender to learn something new and that something new is learning to play the ukulele. It's totally out of my comfort zone, but I'm encouraging everyone to try something new lately. And uh, yeah, I've taken up the ukulele. Hopefully I'm saying it right because I keep getting slated for it in the comment section. I think I'm making more progress on learning how to play this and actually pronouncing it. So what I've been learning to do lately is to just move my hand about on this uh, ukulele because you know when you're doing this yeah your hand actually starts aching so i'm just trying to familiarize myself with the movements and just actually flicking the chords and everything yeah this is how it's actually been like my finger action yeah has actually gotten kind of better Okay, the more I do it, yeah, the better it gets. For you right now, I know it probably doesn't sound the best, but you gotta kinda get into the rhythm if that makes any sense. So let me just keep doing that. Okay, I messed that one up, I messed that one up. Let me, let me try again. too bad was it what i want to focus on is my hand action like getting my fingers in the right place at the right time because not only do you have to focus on this you've got to focus on this hand as well because sometimes i end up playing the wrong string but uh yeah that is how my journey on my ukulele is going so far last week yeah i, I was having trouble trying to count this like I'm, i was always just going one two three four now i could just quickly go point out where the third is the fourth is it's getting easier it's only getting easier because of things like the fender play app which helps me learn how to play the right chords and strumming techniques and uh it'd be kind of sick to see if some of you out there trying to learn a ukulele with me or any guitar that fender do have if you guys are interested then head over to fender's beginners up yourself using my link in the description below fender.com forward slash drizzy and take some of the quizzes they have on there to get you thinking what guitar could be best for you as well as that i'd love to see some of the progress that you guys could make uh, if you did learn how to play the guitar from Fender. Now, let's uh, get my bags and head over to the train station because we have a train to catch. <laughs> yeah. We don't do TikToks, that's the thing. No, we don't do TikToks. Where's the TikToks? No, we don't do TikToks. We have to do TikTok. <laughs> I am not doing that in my life. Days, I'm trying to do TikTok out here, yeah, and he's laughing at me. We're getting kind of bored waiting, you know. <laughs> 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 we're about to board the train but we're just sitting there yeah like uh the train ain't gonna leave us uh, I'm, I'm about to cry man why like we're here we're about to experience what this train's about there's a line right at the front it's kind of confusing of where we need to actually go but um yeah we're about to go to like the front and get in but i don't know where the first class section is i've boarded the train yeah check how narrow this hallway is So yeah, this is the way to our room. This place is so narrow by the way, but it's kind of cool at the same time. We are in B4. B4, this is our room. Let me open and show you. <sighs> Bro, I'm just showing them how narrow it is outside, but yeah. this is our room. Bro, you know we have to share yep. this bed. Let me change the lighting a bit, wait, what is this? This ball makes it dimmer. Oh. We aren't one suite. Oh wait, oh, okay, now it's way bright. Yeah. Room temperature. Yeah, so this is the room. Let me show you. Uh, it's, it's actually quite spacious. I was expecting it to be smaller. My brother was expecting it to be bigger, actually. So yeah, this is the room. We get complimentary water bottle. Yeah. We get a nice dundee. Like a week. Shut up. Uh, 
And then wait, let's see the view outside. Oh wow, oh, shit. we get <laughs> own window. We get a sink to do our brushing. Yeah. Oh, a pencil to. Yep, I'm gonna stab someone up John Wick. Wait, don't don't say that on camera, you weirdo. Oh shit. It's for painting. Oh yep. <laughs> so yeah, let's close this. Uh, actually, I haven't even checked out the bathroom. Oh wow. Wait, what? Look, this is the bar. Wait, where's the toilet? There is no toilet. Oh, wait, that's the bench for the toilet. Oh, the, okay. There's no shower. That's what I'm confused about. So that's the toilet. Oh, it's one of those dingy showers where you stand in. Look, wait. Look, the shower head and everything is in here. So I think uh, you just stand in there and shower. But that's gonna get the whole thing wet, though. Yeah, it's supposed to be. It's like a, it's a wet, it's like a wet room. You're not, I don't think you're supposed to stand on the bench and shower but let me show you how it oh, it's a bit narrow you know <laughs> yeah this is the toilet and the wet room and the shower uh, it's, this bit's quite small but if I was to go for a number two it's actually quite cosy yeah, just sit down on the bench and close the door it's quite cosy no, not, don't, don't actually sit on the toilet <laughs> Yeah, he said it's not bad. What's this bar? Oh, just, just in case you need to hold it and get out. Mm. Uh, let me actually check out the bed. Pillow spray. We've got pillow spray. We've got a hand and body wash. We've got conditioning shampoo and we've got hand and body lotion. That's quite good. Yeah, we've got our drinks and menu. Food and drinks menu. We'll, we'll have a look at that later. Is there breakfast <laughs> Bro, we'll get onto that. <laughs> and we've also got earplugs and eye mask for night time. Oh yeah, bro, this, this is the breakfast thing. So we've got, if you want, if, in the shape of the I don't know, because if we want breakfast, which is included in our ticket, by the way, we just get it and we just put it all outside on the door, which is quite handy. What is this? Pencil case. It's not a pencil case. Oh, there's more body and hand lotion. Bed. I'm not even jumping on it. But I'm feeling how springy it is. It's actually quite cozy. Can I fit on it? Yes, just about. I actually know you can. Uh, a five foot eight guy can actually fit on this bed. Well, so look. yeah. Because if you're short, obviously you're gonna fit on a bed. Bro, this is actually cozy. Is it springy though? I don't think it is, is it? <laughs> no, it's not springy, but bro, it's actually cozy. I will take that. So yeah, the bed is actually cozy. This is my view. You know, I'm just gonna sit in the toilet. <laughs> Why don't you sleep in there? I'm gonna sleep in the toilet. Time is 9.34 and we've actually left on time. Like, look. Oh, wow. Yeah, we're moving. We're moving. We're moving to Edinburgh. We're gonna go to Edinburgh. One thing I'll say is when people walk past you, you can hear them talk. And um, I don't think these walls are soundproofed, are they? There's, There's a host two. call and a window light. Window light. What's the window light? Well, I don't think you should press the host call. Oh, oh. wow. I didn't, I didn't even know there was a light there. Look what I just found. I forgot we even had one of these. And this is our own room key card. We get a room key card. Also forgot to mention, I found this little thing here, look. You get your own table to do whatever you want to do on it. I think this is for like breakfast when we get breakfast in the room. Now uh, for food, yeah, we could either get room service or we could go to the restaurant that they have down there. We are going to head down to the restaurant, order some food and see what the food is saying here, man. We made it into the restaurant. Uh, this is how the restaurant looks. He's happy to have some food. We're about to order our food and uh, yeah, we'll give you a review of how the food actually tastes. But all in all, it's a cozy restaurant, man. Uh, could we get a macaroni and cheese, please? Yeah, of course, yeah. Could I get a, a pan paired breast chicken breast with black pudding? Um, is that on the Highlander? Or yeah. Lowlander? Highlander. Yeah, we yeah. are. We are this is a Lowlander. Oh, it's a Lowlander. Uh, well, where is the Highlander? Hmm? Is it. Highlander is, um, you know, the four William. Oh, okay, 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 no worries. Okay, yeah. yeah. So this is the Lowlander. All right. Um, could I get a... Uh, could I get a mini, mini sliders, please? Um, mini, of course, yeah. Is that it? And could I, could I get a Scottish cheese board? Cheese board, okay, then. And um, the tree of mini sweet treat bites. 
And which one is it? Uh, the tree of mini It's soup. a mini beef slider. Uh, yeah. Yeah? Yeah, that, yeah. Okay. And the what again? Uh, the Scottish cheese yeah, huh? and a tree of mini of sweet course, chili pies, yeah. please. Yeah. Is that it? Uh, yeah, could I get an apple juice with that as well? Of course. Thank you. What's Highland and Lowland? That's bullshit. It's not food. <laughs> Standard, my little brother raging. But uh, yeah, uh, that is what we ordered. So when the food comes, I'll show you how it looks. My drink has come. I got an apple juice. Let's give the apple juice a taste. Actually, a lot of you out there don't shake your juices. Remember to shake your juices. I think you're cool now. Yeah, I'm a bartender. Yeah, really it smells quite good. That's a weird apple juice. Yeah, really Wait, I don't apple juice at all. You know what? That's a banging apple juice, I'm not gonna lie to you. Mm. Our food has arrived here and I found out what my slider is. It's these two burgers. And my brother got macaroni and cheese with some. Bro, taste it. Tell me how it tastes. That looks so nice. Yeah. What's that? What's that black thing? I don't know. Don't tell me that's crispy onions. What is it? I don't taste that onions. What is it? I don't know. Mm. Excuse me. Are you okay? Thank you so much. That tastes nice. I actually like that burger. It's my taste of macaroni. Get in. That, that actually, that's banging. You know, food, the, the food is actually really nice. Okay, we're finally on to our dessert. We probably waited like half an hour to get our dessert because I think they forgot about us. Uh, but yeah, I got the cheese board. And my brother got a tree of sweets. Yep. What even is it? I don't know, it looks like ice cream. Which one should I even try? Which one you ever want to try out? I'm going to try this one. Nice. Mm. My mouth is watering just looking at that, but I'm going to try out my cheese. My favourite cheese is Blue Stilton, so let me... This cheese is disgusting. You, you can't hate cheese. Che oh, cheese, cheese, yeah, cheese is banging. Cheese is just banging. Man. This blue cheese, yeah, just take a look you at know, that. You know what I don't understand, yeah? You know fungus cheese, How can you eat it? It's fungus. How can you eat the fungus? I don't know, but the fungus tastes nice. The whole food, yeah, cost us 37 quid. Would you say it's worth it? It's not bad for that much food. In my opinion, for 37 pounds, uh, it's a bit too much. But uh, yeah, I guess this is what you gotta pay when you're on a premium uh, train, I guess. So yeah, 37 pounds now. Let's go into the room and uh, knock out for the night. We just finished dinner and he is about to be knocked out. Yep, Bro, I'm about you, to go to sleep. Are you comfy there? I am very comfortable here. But uh, like I said, man, uh, this room has actually got a look. If I turn this off, you get a reading light. Turn on your reading light, bro. Oh, yep, yeah, my reading light. He, my brother loves the reading light, by the yeah. way. This is the view from the bed. Yeah, we're just gonna stare into the wall. <laughs> yep, stare right into the wall, bro. Yep. Uh, if you turn all the lights off, wow, it's nice. proper dark. Yeah, like I just showed you, when you turn all the lights off, it's proper dark. I like a room that is very dark when I'm sleeping, so this is perfect bro, for me. You need a dark room to sleep anyways. Bro, you sleep with the light on. Alright, shut up, man. No <laughs> um, yeah, so uh, that, I love that about this room as well. And uh, yeah, uh, other than that, uh, what more could you want from a room? So um, we've got breakfast in the morning at like 5. So I'll next check in with you guys when we have breakfast, which will be uh, delivered to us in the room. For now, we're going to knock out and uh, we'll see you in a bit. I haven't even slept. Um... So yeah, the whole journey I haven't even slept. So I just finished up watching the Peaky Blinders. Um, if you guys watch Peaky Blinders, then you guys know. Uh, let me know what you think of the last season. Um, but yeah, I've literally done an all-nighter and I haven't slept. I've called in breakfast 
for five o'clock and it came on time. So I've got um, tea in one, orange juice for my brother. Then I've got some bacon, bacon wrap or bacon roll. Oh, it's just bacon in a roll. breakfast was a bit of a letdown which is look at that just bacon and bun these KO behind me we're about to get off now in about an hour and catch the train back to London uh, we're just in Edinburgh right now as I've mentioned yeah I wish I could have stayed around here and explored the city more but uh, I guess I'll be back here sooner or later uh, but yeah man, uh, that is how, oh my gosh my brother's literally snoring in the back, this is how uh, this sleeper train experience went, if you guys enjoyed the video and want to see more experienced videos like this let me know when I bring it out for you guys and uh, yeah if you like the video please subscribe, like and share it and I shall see you in my next video.